Okay, now let's go ahead and bring that reference image into ArtRage here. So I'm in the ArtRage gallery. If you're not here, just tap on the logo down here in this bottom corner. If like you have a painting open, just tap the logo and then go back to gallery. So I'm in gallery here. I'm going to tap on the plus button and say I want a new painting. Uh, the standard uh, paper canvas is just fine with me, so I'm going to tap on done. And uh, again, I like to work so I can see the whole canvas, so I make it a little bit smaller. And now let's go ahead and bring in our reference images. So I'm going to tap the reference image button down here. And this first one is a tracing image, which is what we want to have. So I'm going to go ahead and say load image from photo library. If it asks you about, hey, can I access your photo library, just say okay. And then I'm going to tap all photos and go select my bowl of fruit. Okay, so there. It's ghosted it in the background, so it's made it lighter. It's just there for us to trace over and uh, get our sizes and proportions right. Okay, so that's a good tracing image. But let's go ahead and actually load the reference image. This is what normally artists have pinned up next to their, their canvas so that they can paint. So reference image, I'm just going to tap on the plus button here from photo library. And then we're going to load up um, a bowl of fruit here, the same bowl of fruit to be our reference image. If I want to move that around, I've got to use uh, two fingers and I can slide it anywhere that I want. And so this is very, I guess, normal to have your image up here. What we're going to do, since we're not using it to get portions and stuff, we actually use it as a color picker so that we get the colors just right about what we want to do. Okay, so once we've got those two reference images, we're ready to start painting our picture.